Here we go. So let's get to the Baron. And it is raining a hardcore. Yay, experience! That's some serious rain. Guess I better pay attention to the road some. detail into everything. This is pretty awesome. I feel like I'm in the middle of an actual storm. Oh. Sorry, sir. Fire! This is not good. Not again? Oh boy. Run, Roach. Slower. Holy crap. It's not good. Oswin. Where's Oswin? Anyone seen him? Believe I saw him heading to the stable. What? Fire. You blind? Nobody willing to put it out? Ain't that simple. Most are afraid. Baron flies into a rage. He takes no prisoners. My brother's in the stable. We've got to save him. He'll burn alive. Him and the horses. Oh, boy. See what I can do. Hurry now. Quick. Let's do this. Oh, well, there's the Baron. Oh, boy. Not good. Can I knock it out? Can I knock it out? Nope. 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 I'm gonna do this. Looks like rain. Not very helpful. Let's, let's use the ladder. Shit, damn it, there's some red smoke. Gotta hurry. I'm gonna try to save. This is this could end badly. Looks like that's the only way in. I'm gonna burn too. Oh crap. That, that's not good. No, I'll just keep on pushing. Oh, there he is. Oh boy. I'm almost dead. Let me use the front door. Let's run to it. Can we make it? Can we make it? How did I do that? That was impossible. <laughs> We've a hero in our midst. You've earned yourself a barrel of Lyrian. I know your wife miscarried. Was that before or after you beer to a pulp? What the fuck are you suggesting? Don't play me for a fool. You'd been beating them for years. Finally, they'd had enough and fled. Sound about right? Oh, I get it now. They ran from you, didn't they? Yoying! Oh. 
That's what I get for not dodging. That's what I get for not dodging. Let's try that again. Yes, 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 I know I'm dead. Wonder how far back it's gonna take me. Okay, all I gotta do is find him. They I'm gonna be a little more careful this time. There we go, that was much easier. No, I need a little cold water. I'll sober you up. So I'm assuming he just got into like a drunken stupor. Decided to burn some stuff. Sit down. You beat them. I never laid a finger on Tamara. Not once. And on Anna. That's another story. She always knew how to spark my ire. Your wife, how'd she make you angry? Too much salt in the soup? Socks never darned? Twenty years we've known each other. She's seen me drunk and sober. She was there to greet me when I returned the victor. She was there to patch me up in defeat. Like no other, she knew where to press, where to pinch, so it would hurt. You beat her for that, for criticizing you? Oh, Witcher, you haven't a clue, have you? Well, perhaps I shall tell you about it one day. One day, but not today. You knew they had run away from the start. Yes, I knew. Why didn't you tell me? Wasted my time. Say I had. Say I'd said I had troubles. Couldn't control my wife, my daughter. What kind of flaccid prick would you take me for? Gotta admit, I do think you're a prick. Not because you couldn't control them, but because you drove them away. What? Don't play the idiot. You gave them no choice. Anna and I... It wasn't as it seemed. Seems. Alright, I'm all ears. Tell me what happened. The truth this time. I'd been soaking myself three days straight. Anna came to me, said they were leaving. I begged them to stay. She refused to hear it. I tried to stop her. She wriggled like an eel. We struggled. She fell. Last Blasted thing I remember. Woke up in the morn, breeches heavy with my own piss. A large bump on my head. Sadly, they were gone. Know what that's like, Witcher? No. How the fuck could you? I was left with nothing. Nothing! Only the bottle. Witcher counseling, one on one. Tomorrow present for all this, she see you quarrel. Through the doorway, perhaps. She didn't enter the room. Shame, too. Things might have turned out differently. The sight of her always calmed me. 
Signs of a fight in the room. Hole in the wall, wine all over the landing. Was that you? Oi. We tussled. She tried to whack me on the noggin with a candlestick, but kept missing. Hit the wall and the pillar instead. I staggered backwards onto the table, spilled the wine, slipped and tumbled. Anna used that moment to flee. She rushed down the stairs, still clutching that damn candlestick. I caught her on the landing. We fell. I, I thought I had her. Then she turned and smacked me in the head. I blacked out. Don't know what happened next. When I came to, I was alone. So he said that whole scene of hiding stuff. What happened next? Next? It only got worse. I awoke at sunset, not knowing how many days had passed. Thought it was all a plowing, drunken nightmare. And then I went to the bedchamber, and Anna was not there. Instead, there was blood everywhere. I knew she'd miscarried. My breath short, my throat locked. I neared the bed and saw it. It lay there, a tiny thing, defenseless, on bloodied sheets, dead. And it was my doing. Maybe you're doing, maybe not. But that amulet she wore could be important. Or maybe the fact that she lost it. What did you do with the child? What was I to do? Took it out and buried it. Just like that? Damn you! I gave no thought to a funeral. It was a horror. I wanted it to end. That child had been my dream. I told Anna, the little one, our little one, to make things right. Yet she died before she could be born. Understand, Witcher. My child was dead. I sympathize. I do. Thank you. I know that I hope you find your Siri. Deal we made means I need to find Tamara and Anna first. Just so happens your unborn daughter might help us do that. What? How? Sometimes miscarried fetuses, if they don't get a proper burial, turn into botchlings. Into... fucking... what? A cursed creature that draws strength from killing pregnant women. Once it's strong enough, it attacks those who scorned it. But how? How does it know? Blood ties. They're a strong bond. A bond I want to use to find your family. How? One of two ways. Legends claim you can bury a botchling under the family's threshold, perform a ritual and turn it into a lubberkin. That's a sort of, uh, hob. A guardian spirit that could lead me to your family. And the other way? We kill it and draw some blood. Take that to the Peller and he does the rest. I think I Do want to kill my child. lift the curse. It's suffered enough it's my already. style playing. Lift the curse that it may finally rest in peace. Whatever we do, we gotta find the botchling first. I'll show you where I buried her, and I'll dig the grave at my threshold. If it turns out we can't transform the botchling into a lubberkin, they can bury us in it. Handy either way. The sooner we resolve this, the better. Best do it tonight, at midnight. Then wait here with me. Near midnight, I'll take you to where I buried her. Get word to the common folk. Ought to stay in their homes tonight and draw a line of salt outside their doors. And try to sober up. Do I take a shovel to dig up the grave? Take it. You'll need it, but not for that. Oh, man, this is... This is a very heavy storyline. A bit further. Follow me. Give the child a name? No. Why would we? Mistake. 
Names are powerful seals. Here's the spot. Chose a lovely spot. Damn it, will you relent? I'm plowing now I've done wrong. Good. The grave's dug up and empty. What's that mean? Watch things on the prowl. Look! Oh boy. Yep, they decide not to spare any details. Take it in your arms, quick. But if it goes Garrity, it'll bite us in the arse before we know it. Keep screaming and it will turn rabid. It's calm for now. Bloody hell. What happens when it gets plowing restless? It'll bite through your jugular and you'll bleed to death before I can help. Tell me if it starts wriggling. I'll calm it with magic. Pick it up. Take it in your arms. Merciful gods! Oh boy. Back to the fortress. What? This? As I recall, you were the one who wanted to test the old legends, change it into a lubberkin. Oh, fuck. Kinda said it better myself. Oh crap. I'm assuming that this is gonna be the spell. Spectres. Watch the scent attract. Of course, it could not be that easy. Do something. I'm doing something. Killing him. There we go. Oh. Quiet now. I yeah, just have some father daughter son time. What do you want to do with it? Me? Nothing. This is your job. I told you, gotta bury it under the threshold. If the tales are true, by tomorrow it'll be a lubricant. From then on, it'll watch over your house and help me find your family. Push it close. Gotta push it close. What now? 
repeat after me. By the powers of earth and sky. By the powers of earth and sky. By the world that was to be your home. By the world that was to be your home. Forgive me, you who came, but who I did not embrace. Forgive me, you who came, but who I did not embrace. I name thee, say her name, and embrace thee as my daughter. I name thee, Daya, and embrace thee as my daughter. That's a sweet name, I like that. There we go. Good. Now bury the body. Such a dark, dark, dark storyline. What now? In one day's time, Dea should turn into a Lubberkin. I'll stay here and wait. You go home. I'll wait with you. Out of the question. But that's my child. And the guilt, the responsibility for all this, lies with me. Time for parental impulses? It's long past. Besides, nothing else you can do here. But... No buts. Just Witcher's work left to do here. Gotta wait a day and a night for the botchling to turn into a lubberkin. That's it. Go home. And try not to drink yourself stupid again. Alright. Now let's just wait. We can do it. See so y'all have a good one. Take care. Bye-bye.